Yo, what is up, you guys? Welcome back to another Grousin video here on my channel, Sizzler TV. And as you guys could tell by the title, by the title of the video, and we have a specific sneaker here. I decided to pick these up. I didn't think I was gonna actually get these, but I got these at a sneaker store at a locally at my place, the Dog Pound Sneakers. As you see, take a look at the bag and whatnot. But the back of it doesn't say that, or at the bottom. So, that's pretty much it. Uh, it's the Dog Pound Sneakers. And pretty much, uh, they charged me a decent price. The price for this sneaker was $3.30. So, and the retail was $2.10. So, I couldn't get myself raffled in, into the raffle for these. So, I didn't win the raffle. So, unfortunately, I didn't think I was going to pick these up. But, here we go. I got them from one of these sneaker stores, the Dog Pound Sneakers, located in Geneva, Illinois. They're also, they also have an Instagram. They, they're they called the Dog Pound 708. The Dog Pound 708. If you guys want to follow them on Instagram, make sure to go do so. And they also have a website as well. That's the linked link on their Instagram. So make sure you guys go ahead and give them a follow. So enough of that let's go get let's go ahead right into the sneakers so here's the jordan three box your typical you know jordan three box right set that to the side that's all that comes in the bag you know as you see set this aside all right so here is the jordan three box nike logo it looks kind of beat up like if it was old but i see what jordan brown was trying to do they're trying to make it look very classic very old in a way because it is the white cement or some people call it the re-imaged but here it is uh air jordan 3 retro summit white fire red black and a size 11 and a half that is my most common size and we got some jordan logos nike air logos nike air soul air soul jump man nike ink and whatnot so that is all that's in this box, then we got a big front jump man and the red logo. So, all right, so let's get right into the sneaker. Open up the box. There we go. Set that to the side. All right, so. And by the way, uh, let me just give you guys a, a look at my Los Angeles Lakers hoodie. They did lose uh, today against the Chicago Bulls, so hopefully... We can win the next game. On to the next one. So, on to that man right there. 38,000 points, LeBron James, next to the Mamba. All right, so enough of that. <laughs> go Lakers. So, let's get back into the sneaker. So, here we go. You guys ready? All right, let's go. So, here it is. <clears throat> Talking about the Dog Pound. Their Instagram is the Dog Pound 708. Located in Geneva, Illinois. They also got a website, The Dog Pound. So if you guys want to give them a follow, make sure to go do so. So here's the sneaker, you guys. The Air Jordan 3 re-imaged, white cement. A lot of people did not pick these up when it comes to this uh, sneaker. Why? Because they felt like the elephant print in the toe box was off a little bit. You know, I've seen images on Twitter something about that but the elephant print on some of them was off i'm not even gonna lie to you but uh this one without even me being biased you know i was paying attention to the detail with the nike air swoosh the uh elephant print the uh the tongue the jump man specifically the white laces you know, the tumbled leather, buttery soft leather. This is what leather is supposed to feel like, you guys. Everything was uh, was right there in place with the bubble heel on the, on the heel. And the Nike logo at the heel, the tab of the shoe, at the outsole. You know, everything is uh, is correct, you know. So, yeah, uh, I decided to pick these up at the Dog Pound Sneakers. But on the tag, it says 350 but with cash, they give you a, uh, you know, twenty dollars off if you have cash. So I decided to pay in cash three thirty, so not three fifty. Size eleven and a half, as you see, the dog pound sneakers. 
located in my area. They're very nice, cool, down-to-earth people. Nike Air logo. I'm trying to br bring it back with the original pair from the White Summit. And here's the other side of the uh, Air Jordan 3. Oh, there it goes. One more over here having buttery. And there's another look at it. Here's the other side. And everything seems to be in place. Nothing is off. Comparable shoes like the side and side of the toe box. I don't think anything is off when it comes to the elephant print. Everything seems to be right aligned on point. I don't know if you guys can see that. But yeah, when it comes to sneakers, you guys have to pay attention to the uh, detail of the shoe. Especially in the heel tab. Some threes do have uh, on the flap in the back of it some detailing on it. But overall, it's just a really clean sneaker, you know. The Jordan 3 is a, one of those sneakers that, you know, a lot of people, it's one of their top favorite sneakers. Some is the 4s, some is the 5s. But let me put this... Uh, Oh, then you have your Jordan 3 retro card that Tinker Hadfield, you know, gives to the community of the detailing of the shoe. The technology of it and whatnot explains in specific detail, so that's very nice. So let's all, let's put this shoe side to side, get a better bird's eye view. And look at the shoe, so there it is, your... Air Jordan 3 re-imaged, white cement. Um, just overall, you know, it's a clean sneaker. Let me know in the comments below if you guys got your hands into these or you passed on them. I mean, overall, it's a real, very, very uh, overhyped uh, white cement, you know. Then again, it's the brother of the black cement, you know, which I do have still to this day clean. So I put these side to side with the uh, black cement. A lot of people want to call these the re-image, but I will call them the white cement. So there you have it, you guys. If you guys want to go ahead and follow the Dog Pound sneakers, make sure to go do so. They also have a website, you know, where they have essentials, clothing, um, Supreme and whatnot. But um, they have good sneakers, you know. Make sure to go give them a follow on your Instagram. And then again, it's the Dog Pound 708 there you guys have it so if you guys enjoyed the video on my channel and you guys uh got yourself you know the jordan 3 re-imaged white cement um make sure to let me know in the comments below what you guys think you know on the side to side shoe on the look of it uh what are your thoughts about it you know you're are you like happy that they brought this sneaker back you know I'm actually very satisfied with this sneaker, but after seeing images on Twitter and whatnot, you know, something with the elephant print, then again with the stitching, you know, there were some of them that did have flaws. I'm not going to lie to you. Some of them, but not all of them. So um, subscribe to my channel, you guys. If you guys enjoyed the video, drop a like. Show me some love in the comments below. And I have to ask you guys, have you guys gotten your hands into this game? If not, I would advise you to. It's a very good game. Very good. I'm already in chapter 